when we have magnetic field, we have color, we have magnetic force. Exactly. Uh, so now we use our uh, right hand also to find the magnetic force. Okay? Now, the finger is the current. Current going up, isn't it? Yes. Uh, but the magnetic field is going into the page. Uh, so our palm uh, go into the page. Current go up, and if you go into the page, so our force is to the left. Ah, to the left. So let's draw the force. Ah, so this uh, this force. Who experienced this force? I want. Who experienced this force? I do. I do. I do. The second wire. Okay. Ah, uh, the second wire experienced this force. So we put it as what? Label as F one on two. Uh, the second wire experienced the force. Okay, so put F12, F1 on 2. Understand? Yes. Okay. Now, uh, this force is to the left. Now, do the I1 has magnetic force also? Yeah. Yes. yes. Because I2 also provide magnetic field. Yeah. Okay, let's find the magnetic field for I2. So I let's use our right hand grip rule. So the current go up. So magnetic field is this way. Yes. You see? This way. Ah, so let's draw. Uh, so it's use, uh, I think we use black pen That's why it's easier uh, So uh, here Correct, right? Yes uh, This is B2 uh. So at the right hand side The magnetic field is going in, isn't it? Yes uh, But at the left hand side The magnetic field is going Out, out. Exactly uh, Magnetic field is going Out uh, So this label as what? B2. Why B2? Because provided by wire 2. Okay? Now, the first wire, we look at the first wire. This first wire has current I1 and it is under the magnetic field of B2. So we have I and we have B, right? When we have I, we have B, we have force. Okay? Force. So use our right hand also. Okay? Okay, follow up. Uh. So current go up, current go up. So magnetic field out the page. Up the page. So our thumb must show upward. Ah, okay. Ah, like that. Ah, so ah, so our current go up, magnetic field go out of page. Yes. Go out of page. Ah, so our force is to the right. To the right. That's it. Ah, so this one who experiences this force? I1 I1 So F21 uh, F2 on 1 Okay The first wire experience the force uh, This one is the second wire experience the force The second wire experience the force This one first wire experience the force uh, Okay uh, So actually these two force They are actually called what? Action Reaction force You know what is action reaction? They are uh, same magnitude but opposite direction. You see, they are opposite direction, isn't it? Yes. Ah. And conclusion, these two force, these two force like attract both wire. Isn't it? So in the end, uh, you see, you know what happened to the wire? It will like bend towards each other. Uh, it will bend towards each other, like, like kind of compress. Yeah? Ah. So it's uh, because they, uh, the experience Attractive force. Understand? Yes. Attractive force. Uh, okay? So, we can say conclusion I1 and I2 in the same direction, the force is attractive. What do you think about when the current is opposite? Repel. 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 We don't need to do the whole thing again. We really don't know the answer, right? Yes. Okay. So of course, when the current is opposite direction, they repel. So we put this as F21. This one is F12. One, two. One, two. Uh, so when opposite direction, the force between them is repulsive. So uh, what happened to the wire is they will bend upward. Uh, yeah? It's like being repelled. Uh, okay? So, conclusion, when same direction current, uh, force between the, the two wires is attractive, 
when the current, both current is opposite direction, the force between them is repulsive. Okay? And that's it.